the major difference between category one and category two, two institutions. During the job hunt, will there be uh, any priorities by companies based on the institute's category? Absolutely no problem between a category one and a category uh, two uh, institution, especially from an employer perspective, they really wouldn't care. Uh, New Ze in fact, uh, I mean, uh, uh, New Zealand employers really do not care about whether your degree is from category one or category two or whether it's uh, from a university or an ITP or I mean, sure, I mean, it does carry a little bit of weight in certain areas. But frankly, the employer, because I've lived here for such a long time, I migrated to uh, New Zealand in 2001, uh, by the way, guys, saying that so. So I've been here for a while. I I think I think and behave and act more like a Kiwi now than you know uh, uh, than uh, uh, you know my original origin from India. But uh, so I we couldn't care less whether you're from category one or category two. What matters to me as a prospective employer or to anybody else who is a prospective employer is whether we are whether you sit can sit across the table and express yourself clearly and state why your presence in my company is going to be beneficial to me what are the skills you bring to the job what are the what's the attitude you bring to the job what is the knowledge you bring to the job are you a team player are you well presented are you able to hold a good conversation can you talk authoritatively about your subject whatever your subject is that's really what matters in the 30 40 minutes of an interaction of an interview so it all boils down to that interaction and interview. And you think an employer would be asking, are you from here? The employer wouldn't even know uh, what the heck is a category one or a category two institution. So absolutely nothing to worry about, Jagannath. All right. So yeah, and category one and category two, it's more from a New Zealand qualifications authority side of uh, you know uh, categorization, because sometimes when they do an audit and if they find a couple of things which could have been done better, then they're called a the category two, but otherwise they're called a the category one. So yeah, you know, that's the way it is. So it's got nothing to do absolutely with employers, nor will they uh, be uh, interested to know what category of institution you come from, all right?